Okay, so I wanted to do this video because I have a lot of people that are on GrooveFunnels and they kind of got confused on how you would go about setting up your email setup for GrooveFunnels, okay? So I'm gonna go to one of my lists. Uh, basically, I'm gonna go to Manage List. Actually, let me, let me go to my list options, <laughs> list settings, and so I can get into my domains uh, that I have. So I'm gonna manage my emails and you should have the same thing if you're using Aweber. But we're gonna be using this for GrooveFunnels. Like if you were hosting something, if you got a domain on GrooveFunnels, then this is the method that you're gonna be doing it because it's a little bit different than the usual, but you're still following the same um, information. So I'm gonna go waiting for this to load up. And in, in my, I'm gonna to go to one of them that I have here, it's unthent unauthenticated etc. So I'm going to go to view DNS records and you can see that I've already installed this but I'm going to show you what we need to do because we've also got this one that we need to install as well and this is the same for all of them. So if I went into my Groove Pages page and I could just go into any of my pages so I can get into my domain list okay so if I went into any of the pages then I would go to manage domains and then you come into this area where you say it's domains and then you have all these domains. So I'm gonna look for my Limitless Passion uh, Limited um, domain. Okay, so it's gotta be somewhere here. Here it is, all right. And then if you've got it, if you got your domain and you're hosting your pages on GrooveFunnels, come over to the DNS section. And you can see here, I've already got the three stuff that they have for me here. So it's basically very simple. You add a record. You go to C name, you do the copy paste of this and put it here. And then you copy paste this and put it here. And then you cre create save and then you create one, two, three. Now the next one that we want to do is the text. So we're going to do copy, come back here. We're going to choose text, paste that DMARC thing, come back into the domain, copy this come back into the thing and put it in the content and save. Okay, so now we've got that. And in order to check if it's working, because I didn't have it installed before, if I refresh it, you see it's installed, I'm done. Okay, so we've actually, um, I've, it's just, it, we're good. Okay, so this is authenticated. So wherever it's not authenticated, you need to go in and do exactly that. Okay, and if you got an email, you set it up just like I just showed you for each of the things. Okay, so again, you go into your DNS, you add these three into the area where you have it here. You add the records, okay, it's in your DNS, and you add that, and that's it, that's it. Okay, so for each domain that you have, you're gonna do the same thing. Come into the DNS section, add a record, go to C name, okay, C name, and then copy paste whatever Aweber or get responses giving you if get response. I don't know because I'm using Aweber, so I know, you know. So this is how you will get um, approved to send emails out. But like I said, if you are not building a list, uh, do not expect to make crazy commissions online. Okay, it's uh, if you're doing an affiliate marketing in any niche, then this is the method that you're going to be uh, wanting to do is use emails. And build a list okay so I wouldn't be building a list if I didn't think that um, it didn't work okay this is my income source uh, etc so I hope this was um, valuable to you uh, this is for my GrooveFunnels members uh, if you've got a domain on GrooveFunnels if you got a page that you built on GrooveFunnels then make sure you come here and fix your stuff so you can be sending out emails okay uh, because you're not gonna be allowed to and it's February 1st, uh, 2nd. So thank you, and I'll talk to you in the next video.